Hello friends, welcome back to Technique and today we'll be talking about the cameras on the newly launched Redmi 13C. So Redmi 13C is uh, more of a budget device. It's a budget 5G device with a Dimensity 6100 plus chip and it comes with a dual camera setup and also a selfie camera. So it's quite a good uh, package for the pricing it is being offered. It has a very stylish uh, design and looks are also good. Uh, there is MIUI 14 and let's uh, go into the camera aspect. That's more important. That's the one we are talking about in this video. So let's Let's talk about the cameras on the Redmi uh, 13 5G and see how good the performance is in case you are looking for a budget device with a decent camera setup. So let's find out. So before that, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit the red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So let's talk about the camera hardware first. Now being a budget device, there is just a dual camera setup. The primary camera is a 50 megapixel shooter, f1.8 aperture. Then uh, you get uh, a depth sensor. There is no macro, there is no ultra wide. That's quite obvious considering the price segment now on the front panel uh, you have uh, a 5 megapixel shooter f 2.2 aperture that's the camera setup so the primary 50 megapixel f 1.8 and a friend uh, 5 megapixel f 2.2 aperture so let's uh, go straight into the camera samples and see how the performance is so let's go straight into the daylight capture so from the daylight captures you can see here the images are pretty much uh, bright and vivid and there is plenty of details on offer the dynamic range also looks pretty good and uh, for the price segment the colors are also quite good there is a hint of saturation but not a major concern because this is more of a budget offering and overall quality and the brightness levels are good colors are vivid and punchy and does give a good feel altogether and uh, the daylight captures did turn out to be pretty good the sharpness levels are adequate i would say if you zoom in uh, you can see that uh, uh, there is a bit of softness to it uh, it's the images are not really that sharp but again uh, considering the price segment we would say this is quite a good performance from redmi 13c now overall uh, the quality of the daylight shots captured from the device looks pretty good now looking at the close-up images once again there is plenty of details on offer uh, the sharpness levels are once again adequate the colors are rich and uh, vivid and offers uh, good uh, clarity as well so we would say the overall performance of the rear camera in uh, daylight conditions and also close-up shots looks pretty good overall so uh, if you are a person who is looking for a budget offering you won't be disappointed as such uh, with the camera performance of this device now looking at the portraits once again we are quite impressed with the portraits the edge detection is done pretty good the colors are once again uh, quite okayish i would say nothing much to complain here also the uh, the colors are more or less uh, okayish even uh, the skin tones looks pretty good and uh, overall uh, the quality of the portraits looks quite acceptable now looking at the uh, low light shots this is one area where the performance is in that impressive but obviously this is more of a budget device so you can't expect uh, extremely high low light capabilities but here you can see if you switch on the night mode there is decent amount of details although the sharpness levels are uh, not that great uh, the images are soft and lacking details when you zoom in or in extreme low light conditions but i would say it's kind of acceptable uh, for this price segment again i would say there is a bit of compromise considering the price segment now looking at the selfies this is one area where we were really impressed uh, the 5 megapixel does pretty well uh, the skin tones are quite okay there is a uh, good dynamic range the colors are rich and uh, wide and uh, the skin tones are also quite okay for the price segment it is being offered so again the selfies did uh, pretty well uh, job overall and uh, even the portrait selfies i would say it's kind of average performance edge detection is not that impressive but overall i would say uh, the selfies did turn out quite uh, acceptable considering the price segment it is being offered now moving on to the video recording the phone can record the videos only in one format that's 1080p at 30 fps and once again the quality of the video looks good although there is no stabilization being offered the colors the dynamic range and the sharpness levels are quite acceptable uh, for this price segment again this is not a phone now uh, with uh, exceptional video capabilities but considering the price segment this does a decent job altogether so this is the front facing camera sample taken with uh, the redmi 13c it can record videos in 1080p resolution so you can judge yourself how good the clarity of the video is and also the audio output so that is the camera performance of the Redmi 13C. So overall as a camera smartphone in the budget segment, the Redmi 13C does pretty good job, especially with the daylight captures, the close-up, the portraits, the selfies, and the video recording also came out quite good for the price segment it is being offered. That's more important. This is more of a budget 5G device. And for that price segment, we feel this is definitely good uh, cameras on the Redmi 13C. The only area where uh, it was not that great was uh, obviously the low light performance because it's, uh, it's a budget device. So low light 
that performance you can't expect a uh, really great but still it managed to produce decent results with uh, the night mode turned on so if you're looking for a camera centric device in the ultra budget segment uh, with 5g capabilities the redmi 13c won't disappoint you in that price category so that was our experience with the redmi 13c hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day